Queensland researchers have made a major breakthrough introducing vascular cells into model human hearts. It's hoped to pave the way for future treatments that repair damage from heart disease. In a giant leap in the fight against heart disease, a medical institute has introduced a vascular system into beating model human heart muscles. Together in this ecosystem, we have something that is a, is a better representation of the human heart. The new vascularised muscles are known as organoids, each the size of a chia seed measuring just 1.5 millimetres, but inside of 50,000 cells, mimicking the makeup of a heart. And there's a very complicated um, cross-cell communication that occurs, so the different cell types, and that's what we also show in the paper, actually support each other in this process. It allows more accurate testing of new drugs to treat disease disease and inflammation and take scientists a step closer to the holy grail of repairing heart tissue. What happens is uh, if you have any damage or death of the cardiomyocytes, um, they never grow back. So you need to facilitate the remaining ones to have really good function. The research also uncovered the central role the vascular system plays in inflammation to the heart, which causes the muscle to stiffen and fail to fill with enough blood. The cell types in the heart, um, even with no immune system, are responding to these inflammatory factors. So they're sensing that immune system and changing their behaviour. Until now, model hearts used a range of different cells to hold the tissues together and make them beat. But researchers were not able to add the critical vascular cells. The breakthrough opening the door to treat cardiovascular disease, the leading cause of death in Australia, claiming 18,000 lives a year. Lauren Forbes, Sky News Gold Coast.